Given an integer array of nums sorted in non-decreasing order, remove the duplicates in place such that each unique element appears only once. The relative order of the elements should be kept the same. Then return the number of unique elements in nums. Consider the number of unique elements of nums to be k. To get accepted, you need to do the following things. Change the array nums such that the first k elements of nums contain the unique elements in the order they were present in nums initially. The remaining elements of nums are not important as well as the size of nums. Return k. Custom judge. The judge will test your solution with the following code. Int nums, which is the input array. Int expected nums, the expected answer with correct length. Int k. Remove, dupl uh, remove duplicates, cause your implementation, assert k, expected nums length, uh, the for loop. So if all assertions pass, then your solution will be accepted. There's two examples. The first example is 2, because your function should return k, um, 2, with the first two elements of the of nums being being one and two respectfully, it does not matter what you leave beyond the return k. The second example is five because your function should return k five, with the first five elements of nums being zero, one, two, three, and four respectfully. It does not matter what you leave beyond the return k. Right constraints one less than equal nums.length is less than or equal to 3 to the power or times 10 to the power 4 minus 100 is less than or equal to nums which is less than or equal to 100 nums is sorted in non-decreasing order I'm using Java for this solution and let's solve it This Java code is the solution to remove duplicates from an array of integers nums. The remove duplicates method takes the array as input and returns the length of the modified array with duplicates removed. First, the code checks if the input array is null or empty. If so, it immediately returns zero since there are no elements to remove duplicates from. Following that, the code initializes two variables, index and check. The index variable keeps track of the current position where non duplicate elements should be placed in the modified array. It starts at zero since the first element in the original array is always considered non duplicate. The check variable is used to iterate through the remaining elements in the array to check through duplicates. It starts at one since the comparison begins with the second element. The code compares the elements at nums check and nums index inside the while loop. If they vary, it indicates the discovery of a no of a new non duplicate element. In such a scenario, the non, non sorry, 
In such a scenario, the non-duplicate element is positioned at nums index by signing nums check to it, moving the index up to the next position in the modifier array. The check available is increased to advance to the following element in the initial array, whether or not a duplicate was discovered. After iterating through all the elements, the method returns index plus one, which represents the length of the modified array with duplicates removed.